All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to Yes, Your Grace, where I am your king. And today we're back. We're back. Uh, we're still in a little bit of predicament. So I need to figure out. We'll just start off with the the cliff notes. Uh, last week I believe I got a laundry list of things that I need to get, and I have no idea how to get them. And then also I'm in a predicament where I need money, and I have 11 weeks to build up. But just throw. Sure. We seem to gain a lot of that stuff. Oh, God. This is just... <laughs> All right. There's a lot of stuff going on. Hopefully soon we come to some riches or something. I'm going to try to, like, alternate having just, like, the witch or the hunter. And hopefully that eventually gets us some money. And maybe eventually invite the banker over. Why did I buy three cents in spices? What? Oh, I was... I'm paying the bank. So I can't get a loan yet. But... Let's just jump it. Let's just jump it. Let's just get into it. Let's get into it, man. Let's just jump right into it. All right, let's hope to not make some silly little mistakes. But we all know... Oh, it's week 40. Oh, it's just... Oh, my God. Great day. Your grace, I have helped the builder. His vertebrae were twisted. He managed to put... Oh, nice. That's amazing. Thank you. It's no problem. Your, your grace, we have seen your hunter around our village. I'm guessing that the casket has been found and brought to you. May I have it back, Your Grace? Of course. Here it is. Just the way you found it. However, we believe that Slave Co. might have opened it. He was found dead with the casket next to him. No sign of the Eatwar. Atwar? I don't know. This time, though. Oh. Oh. How unfortunate. Well, I suppose he's got what he deserves for stealing. Yep. Thank you, Your Grace. Yep. And then I knew you'd take care of your people. We have gathered some... <gasps> oh! Oh, the ca... Oh, how much is that? Eleven? Oh, you shouldn't have. Hey, next time bring some gold. What, did I say that out loud? <laughs> Sadina! Is that you? What on earth has he done to your dress? Alice is all grown up, uh, grown up dress, so I wanted one too. Don't worry, Father. I didn't do anything to my favorite blue dress. No, but you have ruined this one. Did you cut it yourself? Where did you even get scissors? Are your feather are those feathers in your hair? I found the some beautiful feathers in the gardens last week. I wanted to have a dress like I oh got al asala. <laughs> Asalia. But I couldn't do it like she has it. This fabric just keeps getting in the way. You didn't cut them yourself, did you? No, Father, I'm fine. I just wanted to ask you if it looks nice on you. Fine, you can keep it. But you better explain this to your mother yourself. And I'm telling you right away, she's not going to like it. Why won't she? Because it's not becoming of a princess to wear torn dresses like that. Maybe she will, you don't know. We'll see. Now scuttle off, we have some work to do. Yes, Father, I knew, I knew you'd like it. I have no idea if that... What's up? Your grace, our village has recently been acquired by Lord Grego. <laughs> Shh, fucking Grego. It must be under command by Lady Masha. But now both of the lords are taking taxes from us. They are sending soldiers to collect money every week. And we can't say no to them. We have been paying double taxes for weeks. We tried talking to the lords, but they ignore us. Please help, your grace. I don't have I don't have the money, so sorry, bud. Yeah. I suppose you're wrong. Listen, man. I have no money. I have no money. What do you want from me? Ah, I blessed it all. My potatoes were stolen again. I'm sure someone hidden it at one in their home. How am I supposed to plane my potatoes to a perm? My grain too, but by foods. I knew to moved here. Aha, wakasa. Would one of your hunters help us? Yeah, go ahead. Yep, take him. Oh, if we can find out who's keeping a ton to hide. Oh. oh. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Back in. Your grace, we have found the Redovian king, the monster himself. Die. We gave him a bit of beating for what he did to our brothers. That was not necessary. Forgive my men. They can be heavy-handed sometimes. 
Especially if wearing metal gauntlets. Eck, I finally got a chance to talk to you. How many years has it been? Afraid you would have come, uh, afraid you would come one day. I didn't expect you to arrive as a king with an army. Ah, uh, of course not. We, what are our chances that common Doug would go after our king? But I managed anyways. We took heavy losses, but your army was dismantled. There isn't a happy ending for you. Before I send you off to the hangsman, tell me. Why are you here? Why come to Darwin all of a sudden? Redovian is engulfed in a civil war. We have at least two men made, or yeah, two men made fighting. Two madmen fighting over there. Whoops, for resources. Our soil isn't like yours. It's dark, hard. Plants don't want to grow like they used to. Offer the solution. Cross the mountain and find a new home. Some laughed. Some chose to come along. Your men killed people in the village. They robbed and raped. We're not... We're all not all... We are not all the same. Must have been the men from other camps. Did I mention we're at a civil war? <laughs> These men did the same in my home country. These are the men we ran away from. Rodovia is divided and we had chance can't be tarnished with the same brush. How'd you become king? When you la uh, when we last met your band on the road. How does one go from a thief to a king? A king? That's a bit of an exaggeration to be fair. It doesn't quite work like that on our side of the mountain. Some people choose to follow me, is all. <clears throat> they said I gave them hope. Not everyone gets swallowed. Sorry, I stopped doing the voice. In royal silk as a baby. Now he's turned Australian. Have to work for it. And that's what I did. The witch's curse. There was a witch with you back then. She cursed me if I didn't keep the promise. Sorry about that. Aggie. She has a tendency to throw curses on people left and right. I won't worry about it too much. Aggie liked to use that curse a lot. Never worked. I promise. Thirteen years ago when you attacked us and put your blade against my throat. You must have known I would, would, wouldn't be able to keep my promise. You must have known I would have to have said anything for you to let us go. It was different back then. I was robbing travelers. Never thought I would run into royals on the trail. And when the opportunity arrives, I gift out. I guess the one can get nifty ideas. Of course I knew you would not keep your promise, but it gave me a spark of hope. Marrying a daughter from a royal family would mean Redovian had shot at success on our side of the world. Having royal blood would mean acceptance from others. I didn't think we'd be honored, uh, we'd be an honored guest straight away, of course, but I hoped it would be enough to let us leave cursed lands at least. Boy. The battle was fierce. That's quite a welcoming party you gave us, for sure. When we were crossing the trail, we didn't want to fight. You left no choice. Oh, yeah? We used whatever we had at hand. Surprisingly, we did quite well. We definitely had surprising battle tactics. I'm curious about it. Let me... Ah, let me get off the ground. Oh, boy. oh, that's better. Fire away. What is this? Magic fog. Tell me about the fog. Was it magic? Like I said, we didn't want to cause any harm. The smoke's a common insects. We hoped to use a large amount that would mask the passage. Naive of me to think, uh, naive of me to have thought that the smoke would last long enough to get through. I had hoped that it'd be time, or by the time it cleared, we'd all be gone. When we realized the smoke was about to vanish, we had to take on a different tactic. That's when we circled your men. Monsters? A huge monster, certain, brought a, a lot of havoc with him. Oh, you mean the transit bison? I realize these mammals are quite rare in your part of the world. They're big, strong. We normally use them for transporting goods. But it turns out when you're properly motivated, they can be a strong, or with a strong whip hand, they can act as a pretty good cavalry. Fire? Never seen so much fire magic. What was that? You mean fire flowers? We used their welcome to a new year. Oh, didn't we pick one of those up? Or something that was referenced? I don't know. Maybe. As nice as it, uh, it may have been to watch them. 
We've also had quite a few incidents with fire spreading out of control. I thought those back draws could work in our favor for once. The killing device. The device nearly decide that device nearly decided your fate. We had to, some creative minds on our side. The moment the battle started, our men tried to come down, come up with something that would help us get through. I thought that damn thing was a trap for whoever was inside, but it were plenty of volunteers. We let them loose, and it seemed like it worked well. I suppose the element of surprise did that trick for enough. That's enough. You know, I know a choice. You would have done the same for your loved ones, wouldn't you, Eric? Let me go, and I promise we won't cause any more trouble. I don't want- I don't even want your daughter. You're making this very difficult situation for me. You're a Redovian. If I help you, King Fabian will give an army a battle, but if we sentence you to die, I'll have to go with King Yedrick. Fine, you may go. You've had your chef suffering. I won't add to it anymore. People told me none of- none of the seven kings would grant us recognition, I suppose. I should have known better. At least, I was partially right. You letting me go. I won't forget this. For us, surviving another day is a victory. Thank you, Your Grace. By the way, it seems Redovian's already managed to conquer a Davarin's heart. My daughter seems to be a good fit for you. Oh. You son of a... You little shit. All right. I miss my boy. Can I send a share? No, I can't. He may well. Alright, uh, though, I did think I saw that there's, like, some sort of, you know, I had to get some blue mushrooms, I think. Time, no. Nope. There we go. Blue mushroom. Blue mushroom, yo! Hey, you good in here? You feeling any better? Okay, he's good. Oh, I got a lot of st oh, jeez, and there's also something in here, I think. Wait, what? Performance rituals A, B, C. It's not here. Dubai. Dubai. Is it in this one? There we go. I got the book. Read it. Is there anything about it getting in here? Hmm. Oh, it sounds like what the witch was already talking about. Uh, look at a pregnant woman and the midwives. She's come up in the form of three spirits, a little girl, a young woman, and an old hag. She visits a newborn three days after birth. They decide the future, the fate of the child, a good idea to ready gifts to the feast upon arrival. Three days later, I don't think we're going to be able to use anything. Or maybe this is Conjury, but successful. They might help with more than just a future state of a child. Ah, oh, I just see the exclamation mark after sex. <laughs> uh, can't affect the characteristics of the newborn child. So, okay. The following incantation needs to be performed successfully. Conjury spirit. It is not yet time for you to come. We beg forgiveness for your calling upon. The child at her womb is unborn. We ask you give us what you desire. Let the sky turn red and the water twist black. Let the mountain break under your manhood of your child. Let the child groan, or the groan and the old come to do are bidden. I must warn you, this is a theory once heard at the bottom of the jug and no written text describes such a practice. It does, however, come from a trusted source, a longtime friend of mine. Yeah, good. My friend, never mind. <laughs> and therefore, I have decided to include it in the book. Disclaimer. The author is publishing the company has performed an article and there's no responsibility for any side effects or any damage caused by in incorrect performances of the ritual. Hmm. An interesting read. Oh, yeah, I can't exit that way. Is there anything in this chest? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I tried to go in the I tried to get the chest. <laughs> Alright. Just spoke to him, and to be honest, I don't know what to think. I 
think we... I think we made a mistake. We misunderstood the whole situation. Briar never wanted to go to war with us. What? How is that possible? They would have won, not for the avalanche. They were just looking for a new place to call home. The country is at war. But what about Lorsa? He did want to marry her, to gain recognition from other kings, and to build a new kingdom on a better side of the mountain. I let him go. I didn't have any heart to execute him after finding this out. You did well. He mentioned something about the curse. He said that the witch curse used to curse so many people. Apparently, it never worked. Eric, that's great news. I'm not sure. I couldn't tell if he was just lying to save his own life. Oh, what are you going to do? It's your decision, honey. We're going to go ahead. We are going to go ahead with the ritual. I don't want to take a risk of curse befalling us. Fine, but remember, I can always change your mind, all right? Of course, sweetheart. Whoops. Alright, uh, I'm gonna look for some more paintings. Oh, is, wait, is, is that man dead? Hold on. <laughs> oh, no, he's still here. Good, 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 good. Is there any paintings anywhere? I'm gonna be looking around for some paintings I can sell. Don't mind me. God, this one episode has taken 16 minutes because there is a lot of talking. The hell is... I'm out of here. This door is... Oh, God, my ears. Jeez. Any paintings that I can take? Any painted? Nope, no paintings here. All right, I seem to be running low on these things called paintings. Ooh. Is there a way to throw stuff away? Oh. Well. Oh. Honestly, love the blue streak, not even gonna lie. I assume, yeah. Alright, well, that's the end of this day. We saving some money? Let's see. Oh, I don't like how long it's taking to load. There we go. Negative one. Oh, God. Yeah, the bank's still asking for money, so that's not good. Alright, so we got that. So we go... Let's see. Oh boy. I don't want to go that far. Oh, God. I don't remember. Where was I? Oh, I was here, I think. Yeah. So this is about the halfway point, I would say. So we just need like 150 more. So that's pretty good. Uh, Let's see. Let's... I'm going to do something probably a little crazy. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I think that's a good idea. And hopefully next week, we don't... We'll be done with the bank. Either that or I get a loan. <laughs> and hopefully... Oh, God. Jesus. What you got, my man? Yo, Grace. Oh. Oh. We were the stones of the mountain. Unfortunately, we couldn't do it. The horses were too weak to pull the cart. And we couldn't carry them in your hand either. Thank you for letting me know. I think the pastor is going to visit us about this. Is this the pastor? Yo, Grace. I'm so glad I had faith in you. My itchless skin has completely healed. I did. I'm going to tell everybody that the king is chosen by the god. I'm glad I could help you. Does it give me, like, a bonus? Sedan. Oh. Uh, you've really outdone yourself this time, young lady. A bear? Really? Isn't he the best? Okay. What? She has a bear. Uh. You know what? He's quite something. He's a gorgeous creature. But I can't let him let you keep him he's scary god the music just got he's not scary it's war check he can help us get back okay father please let me keep him he's the best agent 
How'd you get him? How how does one get a bear, pumpkin? I left food leftovers in the garden one day and he's there. Food in the gardens? I'm wondering why they're always in such a mess lately. Is that how you attract all those animals, Sedina? Well, I had to gain their trust somehow. Why this name? That doesn't sound like you. It does. It's with silly names. I'm all grown up now, so the bear gets a grown up name. I think he likes it. Roar! That's enough, Pumpkin. What do you mean? What do you say then, Father? I mean, Your Grace. Can Wojak stay with us? Whatever. He can stay. But if something happens, I will get rid of him myself. You have no worries. Come with me. Roar! Alright, that's the bear. Your Grace, I beseech you. Our granary has been destroyed by a mudslide. Please, can you give us some assistance? Ah, uh, General. General will help you reorganize. Thank you. Yeah, sorry, I can't spend any money. I don't have I don't have money. I don't have this thing called money. There's a lot of things going on. There's a lot of th it's amazing. We had such a long day and we're probably gonna have a fairly short one now. Yo, what up? Yes, father? Have you seen the bear? Said he's your pet. Yes, he's so cool. I wish I had a pet like that. Where does she even get an idea like this? I have no idea. I do have a favor to ask you. Please keep an eye on him. And if anything happens, let me know immediately. What if he eats me alive? I'm not joking. <laughs> I let her keep the bear, but I'm really worried. Fine, father. I'll look after him. Thank you. What's in the chamber? Oh, I guess I'm going to go visit the bear. Oh, look at him sit out. Mr. Pale, is is it safe? It's absolutely fine, Your Grace. Pet, pet, I'll pet the bear. Arr. No, no, stop. Pet, pet, pet. <laughs> Petting from a distance. I like. Is it safe? And I stand right next to the bear. Ah. I know I let you keep the bear, but you really ought to be very careful. And I'm not joking. Anything happens, you run straight to me. You hear me? Nothing's going to happen, Sedina. Yes, Your Grace. I will come straight to you. Father, yes. Found the book. It's about bears. Can I borrow it? Of course you can, Pumpkin. Take the books. Take as many books as you like. I wish Dianka. I will ask Dianka to read it to me later. Oh, that seems fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Eh, sure. Whatever. How do I discard inventory? How do I discard inventory? I need to look that up. How does one get rid of inventory? In yes. Your, your grace. How do I remove items? Let's see. You don't need to remove them since you're actually a. Uh. What? If I double. So, I think this is a uh, load of Bularky. Yeah, that doesn't do shit. Alright. Talk to your wife. Uh, have you heard anything from her? Yep. She came to see me earlier. I haven't seen her. Why? Oh, uh, well, don't be mad. Oh, no. What has she done? You know what she's like. She's looking for a new animal friend. Ever since Luli left, you know, uh, I think she overdid it this time, but I didn't want to have the heart to tell her nay. Abba. Eric, what is it? She brought a bear cub into the castle. What? Are you out of your mind? This is dangerous. This is not happening. 
Hey, hey, calm down. It's just a cub. He's not dangerous at all. He might be nice and cute now, but wait till he grows up. We have guards keep an eye on him. At least until the battle, then he... Or, yeah. At least until after the battle, then we'll see what happens. Fine, but if anything goes wrong, nothing is going to happen. I promise. Suave. Suave. All right. Banker might have to come back and, you know... Might have to get the banker. Give the banker a ring it a ding dong. We'll see. We shall see. I have four gold. Ah! Uh, which one are you? You know, we'll keep the. Today, it's this. So we'll have 15 gold. That's mighty. That's mighty okay now. That's mighty okay. That's, that's a little bit better. So I. I just lose four. It's pay four? Yeah, I mean, like, that's not. That's not anything crazy. Did I do any of this? I did. Okay. I'm gonna definitely get the oil too whenever I can. Oh, God. I just need to send everybody out on vacations. Just, just go. You're all on vacation. Stop bothering me. Please. Eh. Eh. All right, we got it. You know, my daughter's here. Yo, what's up? Your grace, little bird told me that it's supposed she's supposed to be someone I'm not supp what that. I say is seeing someone she's not supposed to. Little bird is another agent. Birds, spiders, but not ghosts. Ghosts don't exist, I hope. In any case, I felt obligated to inform you, Your Grace. I think this is enough royal work for one day. I will now make my leave and play some games. I don't have a good feeling about this. Your Grace, I found out one of the village, Your Grace. Reported it and turned it... Turn that it turned to nothing but ash and made it as I made the final blow. Oh, priest, I'm so sorry. Thank you so much for offered help. Sadly, we're unable to move the stones in town. They were simply too heavy. The wheels of the cart kept breaking because the path of town is very rocky and the horse eventually started fainting from the overexertion. We had to stop and leave the stone in the middle of the road. We could move it if we have a better cart and more horses. Unfortunately, we have already used. Oh. I'm sorry. We need to find another way. Our kingdom's resources are very tight. I understand that. We have already told people we would build this statue for them. They won't take it well. Ah. Your grace, my village was plundered by some animal at night. I would have expected wolves, but, it, but all the meat was left intact. Just herbs and roots are gone. Some say that has been something that resembles a hare. Only bigger and uglier. It seems like a Jeros could be involved. No one has the guts to track him. Um, I would have, but I'm not stupid. He tends to lure people into the swamps and they never come back. I have a family. I can't risk leaving them, but perhaps one of your hunters. I don't have a hunter. I didn't buy the hunter. Jesus. What? Your grace, we are preparing for the burning and drowning of what? To welcome the spring. Our village is bra okay. Annual contest every year, okay. Oh, oh, I know. Perhaps the king himself would like to judge. Uh, yeah, why not? I could do that. We'll be honored to have you as a guest. Anyways, there's something else I came here for. We've had a very bad year. Oh, God. And if you're wondering if we could spare us some resources. No, I can't. I can't. Uh, okay, I didn't take a hit. <laughs> hey, you're you're seeing that purse. I told you not to see. The good news for you though is I know the dad. Yes, father. Why is Maya here? What is she doing here? Maya is not supposed to be in the castle. I love her father. 
Oh, it's true. With her, I feel safe. I feel alive. I feel like I belong somewhere. And if I'm not with her, I miss her so much I can't stop thinking about her. I wonder where she is, what she does, what she eats. If this isn't love, then I don't know what is. I want to see Maya every day. I want her to come in the castle whenever she wants. I see. I can have her away from. I can't have her away from me. Do you want her to live in the castle? Yes. Well, no. It's fine. I just want her to be available to visit me more often. You're a princess. You're supposed to marry a prince or a king even. What's, what will people think? I don't care. I just want to see Maya more often. This explains why you two have been spending so much time together. What do you have to say, Maya? Your Grace, I didn't mean to storm in like this. Alyssa promised to me it's fine if I come in the castle. I do feel the same about your daughter, Your Grace. I don't think either of us planned for this to happen. It's just the, mo the more time we've spent together, the more time I felt for each other. I don't want to cause any problems, Your Grace, but I do wish I could see her more often. Alright. Maya can return to the castle whenever she wants. I wish your sister had the same freedom. Just make sure she doesn't do anything silly, Maya. Keep an eye out for her. Yes, Your Grace. Thank you, Father. I told you he'd understand. Stay safe. Okay, well... Oh god, here it comes with... Uh, uh, uh. Darling. Oh, uh, uh, I found those two playing in the garden before. I didn't have the heart to ask why to leave. But I am a little worried. She's from Redovia. What if they are planning revenge? Don't be silly. They wouldn't stand a chance. I think we were too harsh on her. Uh, said they are in love. In love with the girl? Yes, I think so. At least she's got to find someone she can love. Aw. At least she has got to find someone she loved. With Lurith Lai had had freedom. I want our girls to be happy. Oh, oh, look at that. All right. Oh, there's somebody still. What? Oh, right, never mind. Oh, I shouldn't have invited the banker. I should have invited. Oh, well. Oh, well. Ah, I just gotta, you know what, General, you can, you can stay. How come I only got, like, such little supplies, dog? What happened to my surprise? Four. Okay, so, that's nine. Three, six, nine. Yeah, why do I have... Okay, so nine, okay, three, six, nine, twelve, and then two more. I mean, let's just do that. We're probably gonna do that. I am. <sighs> okay, we are. We are. We are in trouble. We are in trouble. Uh, but find out next time how in trouble we actually are. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you have a fantastic day. I'm trash at this. And I'll see you in the next one. Toodaloo.